good morning. We are in the very last field of cotton for the year. Harvest is about to come to a complete close. It's my dad right there. I don't know. He stopped. He must be out of the picker. Got it down yesterday. We picked, had a good day. Only ran two of the pickers. Hadn't ran the B690. Uh, came in just the other day. But anyway, had a good day yesterday. Got it within 43 acres. I can let it fall. Let's pick up a turn road. Accumulator gets full, he hadn't dumped your bail out. It will blow out the pipes. I know if uh, you've watched some other videos, you've seen me do that. But there he is, he's back going. Yeah, we got it down to like 42, 43 acres. Started on this morning. He started a little bit before I did. Uh, up about four and it was supposed to rain or still it's still supposed to rain it's raining the forecast they moved it back and it's gonna start at like 8 a.m so i drove over to tunica and me and jordan boy helps me milk hunt guy hunts um Stop the stop the drain up so we'll hold water. It's, there's a little water on it now, but not enough to hunt. Turn around, kind of a little shaggy. The field out there looks good though. Used to some pretty good ground right here. That's where we moved to. That's where we finished picking last night. Anyway, yeah, we. That took a little longer than I anticipated. Drove back, got here about 11 o'clock, 11 30 maybe. Anyway, it was just good, good drive. And anyway, it's 11.8 now. It's not even that dry. The sun hadn't really came out today. It's a very heavy dew. So, we're finishing up with harvest, last field. Um, Rain in the forecast about six, seven, eight o'clock tonight. Then it's gonna get to Tunica about four. We're gonna get here about eight. So, 100% chance of rain. I don't know if they're thinking it's gonna be very heavy or not, but. Here's a but yeah, this was, uh, I don't know the exact history of this farm. I don't know the exact history of this farm, but I've always heard it called um, Granddaddy's Place, which would be my great granddaddy's, my daddy's granddaddy. Uh, apparently he farmed it, had cotton on it, and I think out of the last probably 90 something, 98 years, I think they said, it's had cotton on it. But, it continues to make very, very high yields. And as long as we're growing cotton, only two years that didn't have cotton on it was when we didn't have any cotton. Like 2011, 12, no, 9 and 10 maybe. Maybe before then, I can't remember. I was in high school. Pretty good land. Pretty good cotton ground. A couple low spots in it like right here, but Alright, it's a road track dog. 
Here we go. Um, having trouble with the Maggio truck. to put antifreeze in the moisture system, water system, water tank right here. Carried two jugs with me this morning because it hadn't got much below freezing, like 30 and 31, a couple days, but uh, nothing to any, ever freeze any pipes and bust it. But we're gonna be down to like less than 200 gallons see right there and that should keep any uh, these two gallons of antifreeze and they'll, they'll be in the shed or in the not a heated building but probably won't have any trouble with them anyway just in case they get left outside because we do have some lumber dry in those sheds in case it gets really cold before we have a chance to I guess it's winterizing it but <clears throat> we'll put it a little more in the uh, in sprayers, but this will get it all. Give it time when we pick all this, get it all flushed through the system completely, and we winterize. Pick on 
going down. chicken for the last. We both have rain. We've only got 55 inches. Boy, it feels good. That's the end. The end of harvest 2021. I'm gonna have a 70 something, 72, 71, 72 inch module. That's it. Time to clean them up and go duck hunting. Thank y'all for watching. And if you hadn't already, like and subscribe. You'll see a little farm work here through the winter. Um, let me know what you think. Probably gonna have a few dope videos. We may start a new channel um, for the Duck Hunt page. We talked about that uh, for the guide service for Southwoods, but uh, we don't know for sure. You're gonna see how the video and the editing goes along while the, to make sure the hunting still stays as good as it possibly can not let any of that get in the way so but yeah rolling up the last module of the year keep it later completely empty time to manually wrap thanks for watching